good morning guys today is graduation day and i am very excited um as a lot of you guys know in the u.s graduation will not be traditional for most um like high schools and colleges this year my college will be doing a virtual graduation um and at first i thought they were gonna do it live but then later I found out that it will be like a pre-recorded video, just like YouTube videos like mine. Um, so it will launch at one o'clock today. Um, so my mom and I are going to go over to my grandma's house to watch it with her because um, she like doesn't know how to run like any electronic stuff like computers, smartphones, anything like that. So if we didn't go over, she would really have no way to watch the video so we are gonna go over to her house watch the video with her um we are not gonna watch the whole ceremony with her because number one she doesn't know I don't really think she even knows like any of the other students obviously besides me um and then also after the ceremony my mom and I are going to go out of town to Grand Marais because we are gonna go to the North Shore this weekend hike and then next week, starting Monday, I have um, doctor's appointments out of town. So the North Shore was actually part of my graduation gift because we, mom and I went to the North Shore last year, the, not last year, I don't think, a couple of years ago, I believe. Um, and I've been wanting to go. And so this is the perfect time to do it because it is my graduation gift. Um, which I'm very excited for. So today is pretty much going to be graduation day. Um, and then tomorrow and Sunday we'll be hiking. And then the rest of the week will be at doctor's appointments. And I think I'll be uploading like a daily vlog type of thing, like uploading every day. Um, so I am super excited. I, of course, it's graduation day, so I'm obviously done with classes. Um, and I wanted to explain my graduation situation a little bit because of course I was born differently, so all my situations in my life are different. So when I first started at this college in the fall of 2018, I took a test called the Accuplacer. Now I don't really know like the real definition of it, but my definition is that they test you on math, reading, and writing, and if you don't pass those, then that means you have to take classes during your college years that do not count for college credits. And when I did that, I think I missed out on like 10 credits, I think. And in college, that's a lot of credits that you missed out. Um, and so I have to spend an extra semester. So I will not officially be done until December of this year. Um, so I'm going to take a summer class and then I actually only need to take one class after the summer. So the summer class is called human biology and it's completely online, which I think because of COVID and everything, all the classes are online for summer at least. Um, and then for the fall, I will be taking a probability and statistics. And of course, as of right now, and hopefully this will stay, all the classes will be back to um, in person. So I just wanted to explain my situation a little bit because like I said, I was born differently. So of course, not all, but a lot of my situations are different. Um, so I'm not officially done right now, but I will be done in December. So I'm still technically class of 2020. Um, and then what I will be doing is in the spring and summer of next year, I will be working a lot so I can get um, money to save up for my next college. And then next year, fall, so fall of 2021, that is when I will be starting my second college. Um, I don't know if I wanna say the name of the college. Um, I think I'm just gonna keep that to myself as of right now. Um, but yeah, so like I said, my situation is different because all of my situations are always different. So I just wanted to explain that to you guys. So as I'm editing this vlog, I kind of thought that I would um, pop something in here super quick. Um, as you guys noticed, I, or as you guys probably noticed, um, I was not wearing my gown or cap, and that is because, um, I was kind of late on ordering a cap and gown just because 
I won't officially be done till December, so I actually forgot about ordering a cap and gown. And then I ordered it a week before our spring break, which was the first week of March. And, um, and then I kept putting off paying it, and I think it was just because I kept forgetting. Um, but then once my college kind of figured out um, their plan after um, COVID kind of started blowing up, then they had said that they'll give refunds to students who got their gown, which to me, a refund tells me that you will not be getting your product because most of the time when you buy something from a store, in order to get a refund, you have to bring it back. And so I was like, okay, we're getting a refund. That means we're not getting it. I'm not, I'm just not going to pay for mine because I'm just going to get the money back and not get my gown. Well, today, which is graduation day, um, I saw like students posting pictures of themselves, like watching the graduation and a lot of them were in their gown. And I was like, um, I thought we weren't getting our gowns. And to clarify, no one actually told me that we were not getting our gowns. I said that because for me, a refund means that you will not be getting your product um, or you have to give it back. Um, and so that's just what it means to me. So I messaged one of my friends and she had said that she has her gown, but it's a hand-me-down. And it's it's from her older sister who gra graduated 2018, 2019, something within the two, past two years. She's graduated, so she got hers from her sister. But I'm pretty sure everyone else got theirs from the college. So now I kind of, I don't want to say I'm annoyed, but now I kind of want my gown because everyone else has, and I, I don't want it just because everyone else has it. I want it because I thought we were not going to get it. And now that I know that we can get it, then that's when I want it. Um, and so I just want to clarify that, that you guys probably noticed I was not wearing my cap and gown. And that's because I don't have it. So we will be here tonight, which is Friday, and then we will be here tomorrow, Saturday, and then on Sunday, um, we'll also be here, but later in the day on Sunday, we will be leaving to go to Duluth because I have an appointment on Monday in Duluth, and then I have an appointment for my van in Minneapolis on Tuesday, um, and then... We come back to Duluth on Wednesday, and we're in Duluth on Thursday, and then Thursday afternoon we leave to go back home. So I will be vlogging the whole thing, and that it will be kind of like a daily vlog type of thing. I don't really know why this is at a really weird angle, but it is, I guess. I brought my Canon camera to take pictures while we hike um, because my mom wanted me to bring it um, for pictures, so I'm not too sure how much I'll vlog. You guys might just see videos and pictures um, coming from my camera. So right now we are getting dinner um, and we're not gonna really do much exploring tonight because it is quarter to seven tonight or quarter to seven right now. Um, so we won't be doing much exploring tonight but then it'll be Saturday and Sunday will where it will be the biggest exploring time. <laughs> a little weird but it's just because my computer is sitting on a pillow and then my phone is sitting on my computer 
but I just wanted to hop on here for one last time and let you guys know that this is going to be the last clip of today and that we didn't start actual hikes but we did go on a little walk and it was super fun it was quite chilly so that part wasn't fun but the walk itself was fun um i also had a good day with graduation i didn't actually record anything because i genuinely forgot to also my hair is getting super long because None of the hairstyle places are open right now, so like my bangs are in my eyes. The back of my hair is pretty good, but it's usually just the sides and then my bangs that have been the worst. Um, but hopefully when they open up in the beginning of June is when I can get in to get my hair cut and hopefully dyed again. I hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog and I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye!